Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm your host, Anna. How are you guys doing? Happy Saturday. This is a Saturday I'm going to be dropping this video on. It's a Dollar Tree haul. Yeah. Um, if you missed last night, I did do a live. I did. Go check it out. It was a lot of fun. We had a good time. And check out the other videos I have been releasing as well. I do have a hobby, a new Hobby Lobby one for clearance items. I just released one. I went back, found some more goodies. I went to the thrift store. I have that right over here, actually, right beside me. <laughs> I'm going to share with you. I do have um, Shein, but I'm not going to do a try-on because my vertigo is off the chain. But I still will be showing you the pieces, including pictures from the website, so you can see what the items look like on the models. Um, eventually, I will do an actual try-on for you guys once my vertigo is a little bit more under control. So let's go ahead and get into this. Thank you so much for coming by. And I got to do my hair. I got to touch up these grays, honey. Woo, I do. I am breaking out like a little teenage girl. I don't know what's going on. The change is like not being good to me. Not at all. Found lots of cute stuff. First thing I'm going to talk about is the new cleaning item that had the Fabuloso in it. Fabuloso! Yeah, I like Fabuloso. So they had the Ajax with the Fabuloso scent in it, and it smells so good. It's just so good. So I had to get it. We had uh, just finished up the Dawn. So this was right on time. Oh, and it's uh, 12 fluid ounce. And I forgot to say, it's the lavender scent because it's purple. And normally I don't like, I just don't like the lavender scent for whatever reason. I don't. But it's working in this, um, with this combo with Ajax. It's working. But normally lavender is not my jam. It just isn't. Then I did pick up the Brillo Basics Dish Spray. We really like this. Um, this one is in fresh scent. How many ounces are you? 10 fluid ounces. <laughs> so if you see this, check it out because I think you might like it. Yeah, I think you might like it. Oh, and if you missed it, um, I have already shared this room in Fox Hall Manor. And um, I shared this dining room behind me in a separate video this week. But I do have to finish updating this, that one right here. This one right here. <laughs> I didn't get no kind of sleep. <laughs> yeah, I got to finish um, doing that. And I know my sister, my sister just texted me and I told her I'm gonna call her back. I talked to her this morning. Everything was okay. Thank goodness. If you didn't know, if you didn't see it on CNN, I dropped, um, I didn't put that on there, but there is a news article on CNN front headlines about a house explosion in Virginia in Sterling, Virginia, and how, um, one um, firefighter has already passed away and several others, like 11 or 12, were injured. I don't know if those numbers have increased or not um, because there was a, a gas leak, um, natural gas leak, and the house literally exploded. My two nephews are firefighters for Virginia, and one of them works for that station that was there. So I saw that. I immediately started to cry. I got upset. I called her. She told me he was there the day before. He wasn't scheduled for that night. So he's okay, but they're all rushing there. Um, both of them are rushing there to see what they can do to help and go into the hospital as well. So keep our firefighters um, in your prayers at all times because they don't run away from the problems. They run to them and they are heroes on their own. Okay, moving right along. Sorry, it's like I almost started crying because I mean, just the thought of losing them. Um, it's, it's, yeah, it's not an easy one to even think about. Woo, I know. Okay, moving on, moving on. Uh, I got these. Uh, these are some new uh, mats that they have. What are they calling them? Place mats, Moroccan tile. There you go. Moroccan tile place mats, and they are plastic. So if you need something for an easy wipe down, these are great. But I got these for my dollhouse because uh, it has like the Moroccan tile look, which is really cool. I did get two because I could literally cut this to fit whatever space I need it to work in. 
and it's just so pretty. And for $1.25, yeah, because I have several other dollhouses you guys just don't see in this room. Um, eventually, you will see them. But if you go to my playlist, if you go to my dollhouse miniature playlist, you will see um, three of the other ones. And you guys have already seen the Buttercup. I've worked on the Buttercup a lot. And my initial ones was my original farmhouse over here. That's a six, seven, eight room house. And I did maybe two videos with my um, pink cottage that was done by the house of Jack built um, over here on this side. But you guys still haven't seen my room boxes. You haven't seen my lighthouse. You haven't seen any of those yet. So those will be coming up sometime in the future. I promise. But I got to. I have to set it up so it makes sense in here. I'm going to keep going. I know. I can talk about dollhouse miniatures all day. I know. Next thing I found in the... Uh, oh. Stationery. They came back with the three glitter gel pens. These um, Disney Junior glitter gel pens are everything. They're just everything. So I found Mickey Mouse. I know. I was like, I still wet. I found Mickey Mouse and these work out so good. So if you were hesitant about buying these, these glitter gel pens, um, yeah, don't be. They are 1.0 millimeter and they are the three colors on the caps that you see right here. Those are the three colors that they are. And look closely. She is so pretty. Now I do have, if you guys are regular watchers of my channel, I did do a Michael's um, grab box, you know, when they have the boxes for five and $10. Um, not my last one, but the next, the next one or the ne last one to that, I had gotten a whole box of a whole bunch of um, happy planners or stickers and they had Disney. So I wanted to get this and then I wanted to do a whole layout with that. Because I'm really not a Mickey fan, but now I am. <laughs> I guess I can do like something really cute. Okay, and then they also had the LOL dolls. Oh, who doesn't like an LOL doll? Who? So let me show you the difference in the colors. Those are the difference in the colors from the Mickey, Mickey, um, the Mickey Mouse, you know. There you go. So those are the differences. So stinking cute. And um, if you've if you haven't seen, I've done my notebooks where I decorate my notebooks and we use what we got. We use our stickers, our papers and everything. I recently did one with you guys. This is like just using whatever we have, just using whatever we have to decorate our notebooks that we're going to be writing in, utilizing. And it just makes it so much prettier when you use them, but you're, you're using the things that you're purchasing. So it's great to do that using all your washi. Yeah, so I encourage you just to take your goodies out, take out some notebooks that you're going to be writing in and decorate them, okay? All right, the next thing is, let's talk about this Air Airheads gum. This is with micro candies and raspberry lemonade. This is considered a paradise blend. Yes, it is. I've never tried it. Have you guys tried it? Let me know down below. Let me know what you think about this one because I've never tried it. So I got that one. So the boys and I can try it out. Then I did pick up from the Easter department. We'll talk about Easter. I know. Just take a moment. <clears throat> I got time. Take it. Take it in. Take it in. No. Take it in. He even has a little heart on the face. I know. It does have this. They have a whole bunch of really cute different style buckets and things to use to create baskets right now. This is for me, for my craft room. I'll be putting, um, you know, materials and um, probably fabrics that I'm going to be using to make um, projects and notebooks and, you know, curtains and beds because I do have DIYs for beds and all kinds of things for my dollhouse and other things, including junk journals. But I'm going to be utilizing this for that because I like cute things. <laughs> now, they also have this in a purple. 
So yeah, they have this in a purple, but I got the white and the pink because I thought they were so cute. Look, they got the little heart on the face too. It is nice and big. It's nice and big to put your stuff in and it looks stinking cute. I know on a budget, right? Cute storage on a budget. Crazy. Then they have the two piece tubs and I thought I can use these in here too. These are two pieces in here. They are plastic and this one has all these cute little eggs. There you go. You can see it better now. And if you see them in person, you will see they all have little individualized um, styles on there. <laughs> it's like I'm, I'm with that word, styles. Okay. So these, again, I'm going to use a storage here in my craft room. And then this one, girl with the little pink truck and a wreath. See, I even though it has eggs on it because they're cute and they're pink, and I'm trying to get like my pink on right now for whatever reason. It's just like I like everything pink now. I do. And uh, there you go. So super cute and functional. Love it. So dollar twenty five, honey. You can't beat it. Also in the Easter section, I picked these up. Now they do bring these every year. Um, these are the silver plastic cut cutleries in this part of their spring fling line. And I did pick up the purple. Yeah, because they're just cute. And, and we do use, you know, plastic utensils sometimes. So sometimes, you know, you got something a little going on. You might have a little company. You want something a little bit cuter, you know, so you just break these out. Or you could do the pink. <laughs> so you could do the pink as well. Super cute. And they had it in this like really bright, bold uh, yellow would be amazing for summertime. Amazing to have a little, you know, invite invite whoever you want to invite over, have a little coffee, have a little tea, have some cake, have your cute little spring fling utensils out. I mean, they're so cute. Look at that. So pretty. So I got those. And see, everything I'm picking up, I can utilize. I love that. Then um, I did pick up this new uh, collapsible storage container. And she looks like this. I know the wind is howling out there. Can you hear the wind out there? I know. I'm going to stay in Maryland. We did get some snow last night between, I think, 1 and 4 in the morning. But it didn't stick to the ground. But it definitely got on the houses and on the grass. Then it was melting this morning and now it's, it's not melting anymore. Now it's just really windy. But this is a storage container. It's 11.25 long by 11.25 width with a six inch, six inch height, but it has a little cover. And so let's pop her open. I wish it came in pink. It didn't, yeah, it didn't come in pink. It came in this navy and gray. Navy and gray. So, so I guess that's the lid part. Okay. All right. And then you just pop this one open, the little bottom piece. Put it in there. Let's see what I think about it. I mean, these are always great to use, but this one has a cover with a Velcro. Oh, it has a Velcro cover. Okay. Let's see. Make sure I make it look pretty for you guys. Make it make sense to see what it's actually going to look like for real, for real. No, we want to see it not done for real, for real. Okay. Uh, that's, th that's how it's going to look. What do you guys think? Mm, I don't know. I guess this would be nice. You know what I could use this for? I can put some of my wax melts in here because I am an independent Sensi consultant and I could put some wax melts in here. Yeah, I could use it for that. That's going to be an easy open and close because now I'm, I'm using my Michael's little plastic, not plastic. They're really pretty boxes. They have the magnetic um, thing that goes down like that. I'm using those, but I can use, utilize this as well. Okay. Huh? It's just okay. When I run out to get it, no, I, I wouldn't, but I, I was curious. 
I'm glad I got it, but I was curious. Okay. Now in the uh, body department, I got the, um, the Modest Basics Alcohol-Free Disposable Washcloths Enriched with Aloe, Chamomile, and Vitamin E. You get 18 washcloths in here. This is towards my preps. And I'm looking like a Oompa Loompa right now. I'm not too sure why. This is towards my preps. And I found the Yardley. <laughs> so they had the Yardley alcohol-free enriched with aloe vera, chamomile, and vitamin E. 18 count. This is a 12 by 8. And this is a 12 by 8 as well. And they're both 18 count. Um, Yardley feels thicker. You see how thin the, the Modest is versus the Yardley? The Yardley is a lot thicker. So be on the lookout. This is just a great one to have as a backup emergency. If you lose your water for a day or two, you need to clean up a little bit. You have those type of things readily available. Those are nice to have. Okay. This is the medicated body powder. And when you use this, you guys, this does have a cooling effect for the first, I want to say few minutes and then it dissipates. So if you're looking for something with a cooling effect, this one would be a nice one to do. I do like to use this. Feel fresh and healthy. Formally helps absorb moisture, soothe, and um, relieve itching. And it does have menthol. So just a heads up. It does have menthol. And it, it does not have um, no talc. Because that's the bad stuff. This is um, starch. ZMA's cornstarch. So there you go. I, I recommend that one. That one's actually a good one. It is. Then I did get a box of tissue. So there you go. Now make sure that you come back. So we'll be doing some more things with our notebooks and our journals. I'll be doing a happy, a new happy planner layout for this week. Um, I'm also going to do another update on one of these other rooms. So come back and find out which room it will be. And um, maybe trying to do a DIY, possibly. I did have a request to do some jewelry. And because I do make jewelry, I just never record it. <laughs> I don't share it here. It's just too hard to film. But I'll try. I'll give it a old college go. And a lot more to come your way. So thank you so much for coming by. And I'll talk to you all later. Bye.